Hi guys, Mantas here. And in this video I will show you how to check your website for broken links. I will explain what is broken link and how to fix that. So broken links are two types. One type is when you linking to external source. Let's say I'm writing an article about and as a source or citation I will mention someone else's website and will link to it. And during the time that website might, might be closed down or they might change, you know, URL and it's not accessible anymore. Or another type, it's your inner pages. If you change your URL structure, let's say from books to books for sale, one of the that pages will be broken. So you have to redirect old URL to new URL. So in order to check for broken links, uh, I suggest you to use free broken link checker. And I'm going to leave all the sources in the video description so you can easily access them. So simply you just land on this website, type in your website name. And I'm going to run a test on my own website now. Uh, and you have to enter that captcha and you click on find broken links and now it starts scrolling your website and looking for broken links whether it's gonna be external or internal type All right, so the test is finished and actually there are no broken links on my website or whatsoever, but I just created it on my one of my pages just to prove you it is really working. And now you can click on URL where that broken link exists. So when I open my website, I, I'm going to scroll down, down, down and I can see this is broken link. Don't click. So I did it on purpose just to prove you. So this tool is really working well another uh, option is i recommend for everyone to use a uh, rank math plugin because it has redirection uh, function built in yoast comparing to yoast yoast got the same function just in a premium version another if you if you're using yoast then I recommend to use another plugin which is Broken Link Checker. And this plugin basically will check your inner links and external links as well and will notify you if there are any of them. But what about if you're not using WordPress and you can't use any of those plugins? So simply run your website through this tool, make a test, and then you will have to edit your HT access file on your server. So this this is a simple line of code for one redirection and what I usually like to do to make a comment let's say this is permanent redirect redirect and this comment will not be executed now grab that line of code and it's going to be permanent 301 so old URL, let's say our old URL was books and our new URL is, let's say, books for sale. This is very simple. You will have to connect to your server and locate HT access file, which usually sits on the root directory. Then edit that file, copy and paste this code, for example. And it will make that redirection on a server level. All broken links in Google Eyes will show your, you haven't got enough authority and trust. So this is a part of Eat SEO and it's really important. Every single little thing matters. I hope you like this video. If you learned something new, give this video a thumbs up. Leave your comments in the comment section and I will talk to you soon. Cheers.